Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, right, so today, <laughs> today I'm very late to a party and I'm aware of that. I know that like watching my old videos, videos were a thing ages ago. I'm being fashionably late, at least I don't have a million other people doing the same video to compete with now. <laughs> but I just was looking at some of my old stuff. I was looking at it the other day and I was cringing pretty hard and I thought you might find it interesting. Um, I find myself to be pretty cringy at the best of times. The first couple of videos I thought we'd watch uh, were never on this channel. They were on another channel. They're not public anymore. I have a lot of stuff private on my main channel as well. I used to go back and private lots of old videos because I was just like embarrassed by them. Something in my eyeball. Uh, I have glasses on. I should have extra protection from things getting in my eyeballs now. God damn it. Hello. <laughs> um, uh, ooh, ooh, I wasn't prepared for this. Uh, um. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Great video intro. I'm just like, uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I worry about my video intros now. <laughs> uh, I wanted to just say hey again and to everyone else that doesn't know me um, because I'm gonna. Oh, look at my fucking hair. <laughs> Sorry. I'm. I'm gonna start doing a lot more on YouTube again. Uh, <laughs> oh really? <laughs> I'm gonna start doing a lot more on YouTube now guys, I promise. I stopped for a long time because... What's going on there? Because um... Because I went to uni. But <laughs> just for people that don't know me, uh... The internet knows me as Kizzy, but my name's Kira Rose. Uh, I'm a filmmaker and a photographer and sometimes a model although... Oh, no! <laughs> Why is that so cringy? So people on the internet know me as Kizzy. I'm a photographer. <laughs> it's all true. I have done all those things. I'm a filmmaker and I've done photography. I think I'm quite good at it. Um, and I've done modeling and stuff, but I was so young at this point. And I, this was 2011. I swear there's just something about teenage you that will always make you cringe slightly when you look back at it. I don't know, perhaps it's just me. Maybe this is just me. Everyone else should do it because it's really good. Before I buy anything now, I always look on YouTube for reviews <laughs> and you know, people applying whatever it is that I'm buying. Great tips. It's 2011, all right? Not everyone had thought of that yet, maybe. <laughs> I think that's a very underrated but good use for YouTube is these like tutorials and reviews because it's so handy. If you'll allow it, may I look cool for a second? Slightly cool? This is me showing off with my nunchucks. I don't know if you know, but I can nunchuck a bit, a half decent amount. I can chuck a good nun if I have to. And this is just me showing off with my little nunchuck routine that I'd learnt and showing off with my editing. I filmed it from like a bunch of different angles so I could chop it together all quick. I can't play it with the audio on because I used Black Betty by Ram Jam, but just imagine it. Whoa, Black Betty, bam and Like, it was good, <laughs> trust me. <laughs> oh, that danger look in my eyes. I'm like, oh. <laughs> I'm totally just like, I'm Xena. Yeah, I'm just like Xena. I can nunchuck like Xena. Those nunchucks I bought inspired by the film Domino. I think they look quite a bit like the ones she used in that film. I think my nunchuck and skills are not bad. What do you think? Hey. Tips for living with a dyed red hair. This was my first video that got quite a lot of views, I think. <gasps> my old intro, I forgot about that. <laughs> Were any of you watching when I used to use that intro? Hello, I did just film this video and then I looked and my camera wasn't recording, so play on! These are some tips for people with um, red hair, Can I dyed red hair. just like appreciate how much better I've got at makeup for a second? Not that like this is completely, completely awful and terrible I guess, but I didn't think I was very good at makeup like now. But looking back at this, I have made progress. <laughs> I'm not wearing any lip liner though. I wouldn't be caught dead wearing lipstick without lip liner anymore. <laughs> I'm just wearing lip liner today. It's either lip liner and lipstick or just lip liner or nothing. <laughs> there I was 
going just lipstick. I was going bareback and it's scary. <laughs> also the fringe is kind of sweeping to one side because I was starting to kind of try and grow it out into a side fringe. It obviously didn't go to plan. I had a block fringe for the next six years still, <laughs> uh, but I'm doing a much better job of growing it out now. There are special shampoos that you can get that don't have a certain ingredient in that is, you know, the, is, that is really bad for dyed hair but they're really expensive and I can't remember what they're called but if you're rich look into it because it may help you out. <laughs> rich. <laughs> sulfate free shampoo is what I was thinking of, trying to think of. To afford a sulfate free shampoo you need to be rich. <laughs> this is my outfit of the day. I'm not going anywhere. I'm just staying in, sitting about. So I thought, <laughs> and peace because I'm thinking about being peaceful today. I might look at some of the comments on this, like the most recent ones. <laughs> Someone commented 2017 question mark and it got six thumbs up. Do not be watching this in 2017, okay? Uh, I mean, you can if you want, but there's loads of videos that, of mine that didn't get many views, that I wish had more views, that I worked really hard on. Go back and watch them. <laughs> I'll make a playlist. No, I won't, but oh God. Oh, as if people are still watching this 2017. The thing that comforted me was the thought that no one was going to be watching this stuff anymore. <laughs> Thanks for ruining it. No, I'm joking. Thanks for still watching my stuff, but <laughs> you kind of remind me of Jesse J. Oh my good God. I've been compared to Jesse J so many times. I've had Jesse J and Lily Allen shouted at me in the street before. Is it because we both had a block fringe at one point? <laughs> I don't think I look that much like them, really. Do I? Sounds like something I'd want seeping into my scalp. I think this person is having a little jab at hair dye. You tell that hair dye, Alistair. This video is called Love Heart Slash Pin Up Hair. This is my first hair tutorial. Ding! <laughs> It's pretty good actually. I don't know if I could even do that now. Hair tutorial for a, Whoa, a my friend. She was going on with my friend. <laughs> it's kind of sad in a way because I wasn't quite so self aware back then. I like that was probably just this was probably done in one take the whole video. Whereas now sometimes I'm repeating myself quite a lot. I'm like, that didn't sound right, and I'm really picky about how I say things, and I kind of obsess over little things, which I guess is just a natural part of it's suddenly becoming your job and more and more people watching, you're gonna like scrutinize everything a bit more. So even though I find all this cringy, it is also quite sweet, bittersweet in a way, seeing me not caring quite so much and just like doing it. Um, and sometimes I'll just get these bits and put that back like that. This is the zombie tag and I put in like loads of effort for this. <laughs> and actually I think it's quite good. It's probably going to be mildly cringe because I'm acting in it, but I remember being quite happy with it. I'll be fine, I promise. I'll go see Amy &E in the morning or something. But I can't be bothered to sit in. <laughs> the difference in the audio. <laughs> I didn't have a microphone at this point. So if the shot was filmed from far away, it sounded like I was far away. How do you like my acting? I'm in waiting room right now. I'm absolutely shattered. I just... I might just go to bed early tonight and it doesn't feel too bad anyway I mean I think it'll be a couple of stitches of anything but it's not that bad I think I can survive to the morning the audio I used in this for the thing we're listening to on TV is George Carlin talking about stuff it's a really funny bit I'll link it down below if you haven't seen it back there just trying to find a place for myself. You know how important that is. That's the whole. That's the whole meaning of life, isn't it? Trying you to right. find a place for yourself. <laughs> you don't feel very well. <laughs> Alex is such a better actor than me. I'm going to bitch you. It's fine. It's fine. I'll go tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Alex's hair. <laughs> yes, Queen. <laughs> this is BBC Television from London. Creepy music. Normal programming has been suspended. The current threat level is critical. Civilians are advised to stay in their homes. Evacuations are currently taking place in the London area. I'm a zombie in the house. Oh no, I'm gonna buy him. Oh, Taz. Taz has passed away now. Oh. 
Oh yeah, I eat Taz in this. Oh, he's a little butt. <laughs> that was Alex's bedroom. That was where we would sit and cuddle when he got back from work. Oh, the early years of our relationship was in that bed a lot. Sounds dirty. I didn't mean it like that, but. <laughs> oh no. That was a teddy bear <laughs> that I was holding. I covered in fake blood. Boots me in the face. I love it. The sound, the zombie noises, that's not me doing that. That's Alex. Because I sucked at it. I just couldn't I couldn't do zombie noises. <laughs> Oh, let's watch Judge Bread. The whole idea for Judge Bread came about because me and Alex were chatting about Judge Dread, and I think I accidentally said bread. And then this whole thing formed in my head of someone that judges bread with the same intensity as Judge Dread <laughs> judges people. Hi, sir. How can I help you? I want to complain about this bread. I'm sorry to hear that, sir. What's wrong with your bread? This bread is too chewy. It hurts my jaw. <laughs> Oh no, that's not good, is it, sir? Why not try this bread? It's best of both. <laughs> Hello again, sir. I don't love this bread. Hmm, that's a shame. Best of both is one of our <laughs> best ones. Do you know why bread jokes are always funny? No, sir. Because they never get mold. I don't like this bread. They do get mold eventually, <laughs> sir. I don't like this bread. Give me no bread. No. Oh, it's too soft. You call this a slice? I'd like to make a complaint. About bread by any chance, sir? No, about the soup. Oh, okay. I lied about this bread. <laughs> okay, sir. Can I take a name, please? I am um, bread. <laughs> oh my god. Alex makes a great little shop assistant. I put a lot of hard work into making that helmet out of a box <laughs> and some felt tips. I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it and I will speak to you again soon. Bye-bye.